Hello and welcome back to Subsistence. Now I'm starting this game um, from the menu this time round because uh, last episode, as I was uh, saving and exiting from the game, I heard the pitter patter of hunter feet. So I don't know what I did to disturb them or him, but uh, yeah, I think I better start recording this episode from the very uh, the very beginning we load the game so let's see what happens <clears throat> hope you're having a good day. there we go <laughs> cheeky bugger all right let's get a gun out oh my word look at him there you little all right let's oh he's throwing grenades i'm in no position to fight back <laughs> oh, you bugger. You little sod. Come back into view. Come on. Another grenade. Oh, oh my god, look at the wall. Oh. Wow. What on earth have I done to deserve this, Hunter? <gasps> no, he's going to break the wall. He's actually broken into my base. How about that? He's run off now. Wow, he did a good job. He <laughs> did a good job. Look at the arrow. Oh, well, that's a bit unfortunate, isn't it? You little sod. You wait. <laughs> He's broken my door and the wall. Yeah, I was in no position to fight back. I've got, like, I could have. Well, yeah, I should have done, probably. Well, how about that then? Right, we need to get some logs. We've only got two planks, so I'm going to go out there, get some fibres, get this wall replaced. Oh dear, oh dear. So logging is going to be paramount today. Uh, we've got enough stuff in there. How are we doing for food? We need vegetables as well. Okay. Well, I can't worry about that at the moment. So obviously that was quite exciting, but that was the hunter from the way he ran off, the hunter from over there. I've obviously upset those guys, or that guy. Uh, this is going to be a bit of a problem here then I think. Um, I'm going to have to extend, it, it tells me something about my build anyway, that I'm going to have to extend my build this way to stop them from coming here. Uh, that's going to take some time to get sorted. I haven't even made a hammer yet. I think I might dismantle those walls and just put them back rather than try and repair them and make a hammer. It depends how much everything is. So I've obviously wondered Far too close. But that was quite exciting anyway. It's nice to see the wall explode. Look at all my storage and all the equipment on the other side of the base. So I think we're going to need a second defensive uh, wall over on that side of the... Uh, that, that's what this tells me anyway. A second defensive wall over on that side. <clears throat> so a bit of a dramatic start to the episode. Yeah, I was just logging off after the last episode, which you can see was uh, at the weekend on Saturday. And I heard, uh, yeah, I heard footsteps and thought, oh jeez. <laughs> I hadn't got time to uh, sit and deal with that then, so I 
saved and exited the game. And that also tells me um, that that uh, solid wall on that side isn't going to work out very well because if he's going to come from that direction uh, to attack, then I'm going to need some windows on that side. That's for sure. So it's all good. That top window's done. That top wall's damaged, so we may as well replace it. Now we know. I do apologise. I've got a frog in my throat this morning as well. <clears throat> it's gone very warm here again in the UK, and uh, oh. summer's not my favourite. So this one's going to be a bit of a, you know, log in and... But I do need fibre. I've been using too much fibre maybe on fire bricks this early on in the game. For a lovely dramatic, uh, dramatic start to the episode at least. Uh, right, I better not go any further this way as soon as though he was the guy I upset without realising it. <laughs> oh, I love this game. It's so funny. Oh, you've already got you. There's a bear down there. I'm just going to get all these local logs, I think. It takes so many logs to repair everything. Better keep an eye on that bear. I should have taken that hunter out, but I didn't have a good spot. I, I would have needed to open the door. He's got grenades, he's got a shotgun, I've got a pistol and a bow. So um, I think I did the right thing. Sacrificed a, a wall, a couple of walls, and a door. A little bit of repairing. Won't take us long. Can rejig the build a little bit. Now we know that side's going to be uh, a popular spot for them to attack. Um, and I can uh, put a window up on that higher level. and actually be able to um, get a good shot on him if that's what they're going to do so it's all good right okay let's start making because I was given some advice over the weekend in the comments about crafting on the go uh, and I did used to do that in the old game but I had such an established base for such a long time you get into the habit of not building anything. Um, you know, as you go. Um, so... At least we'll have some planks ready for when we want to do the building. The problem is I'm going to need some fibres. I've not seen many uh, just yet, actually. Keep an eye on my uh, stamina. I haven't purposefully eaten those two berries that I've got in favour of um, I'm trying to make myself thirsty enough to drink the berry water because I think that's a little bit more valuable at the moment. That bear over there behind the tree is practically riding down in that hollow. Can you see? I mean, you could quite easily run into him without knowing he's there. All right, I'm going to need some fibres, so... Uh, he's a little bit... Well, he's wandering off now. Let's see if we could get round here and... Oh, actually, we should have a look up here before we move on. Did I reload? I did. I don't have many uh, rounds for some fibres now. We've got some logs, we've got some um, 
planks on the go. Repairs are the priority, I'm afraid. It's not exciting stuff, but it needs to be done. Right, okay. How dramatic was that uh, blast though? That was cool. Right, we've got a chicken over there. Yeah, I've got some arrows. Lovely. We've we'll got this crate. I'm thinking that was probably the wise thing to do with that hunter. For now. Um, oh, lovely. Right, we'll eat a uh, protein bar. We've got to keep let's drink. We've got to keep our um, fruits and veggies up. Oh, scrap. Right, let's carry on. Yeah, I if I'd have got into a, a firefight with that hunter, I've got one pistol. I've only got a couple of um, health items. Um, which I can't afford to waste. I just can't. So I've walked away without any damage um, and just a little bit of uh, rebuilding to do. So and as I say, it was kind of cool to see see the dis the destruction. So it's kind of put play, paid to all my plans I had. Um, I really want to get the well, which means I need to get mass storage, I think. I can't quite remember. We do need to get some more rabbits for some more cloth. Not sure if I heard a bear then. <laughs> It was funny seeing that hunter running off in the distance. <laughs> oh my god, so funny. Hmm. There's some ores here. What have we got? We've got some... That looks like iron. And we've got a wolf over there. And I did see a chicken. Hmm. Is it worth going all the way back over that way when we've already s oh, we've already seen all the uh, fibres? Oh, lovely crate at least. Yeah, that was quite an exciting start to the episode. It's a lot of fun. Let's make some cordage then. Uh, we've out oh gosh, that's not great, is it? We need more fibre. We might have to resort to uh, putting um, logs on the fire. I really do prefer fuel bricks if I can. Oh, good grief. <laughs> Look at him there. There is a, another crate just beyond him there. I wonder if it's worth circling round. not letting me have those. Oh, there's a rabbit. Right, now the thing is, I saw a wolf somewhere. Can we, uh, can we get this rabbit without also attracting that wolf? Oh yeah, it's quite a way away. We'll be okay. Oh, okay. Um, he 
he's guarding that place. Has this bear given up on this one yet? Can't see his um, bar anymore. Okay, he was hiding. He was for sure hiding. Now, is this a lock crate up here, or is this a? No, we can get you. We need water. I've only got one. I think we've got some back in the base. What time is it? Yeah, we're okay for a little bit, but not too long. I think we should probably head down into this area now and uh, try and get some fibers. I don't think it's worth going back for those crates. We've tried three, two or three times. got a chicken. I'm running short of uh, arrows. Damn. <laughs> damn. Damn, damn, damn. Where did the arrow go? Good grief, there it is. This is a bit of a little tricky area, isn't it? Let's have another go at this chicken because we do need food. Okay, good stuff. Right, fibre, fibre, fibre. We need cordage. So we're going to have to weigh up whether it's going to be better to make the hammer and repair the existing or just replace everything and get some um, materials back. I think I can see a rabbit here, yeah. I'd like to get the rabbit as well if we can. Lovely. We need cloth. We need cloth for the bed. We need cloth for oil bandages, health kits. If we're going to take on any more hunters, hopefully we haven't upset anybody today. <laughs> anybody else at least. I really didn't realise we'd um, wow that was quite vicious I didn't realise we'd done uh, got that close to a hunter previously to be honest so yeah that was a bit of a surprise that wolf was right by my base oh good god I knew there was a bear there, you know, earlier. I thought he would have gone by now, though. Oh, I'm going to have to move around the long way. Did you see me jump then with the mouse? Oh, I love this game when it does that to you. Now, the wolf that was by my base is going to be over this. Yeah, there he is. I'm going to have to run between them, I think, jump up on the base. Um, hmm. Oh, he's only a level one. Is it worth? Is it? I wonder. Right, that's given me a little bit more confidence back that uh, that was because uh, the, the death um, against the wolf in this situation was because it was a level three wolf. And uh, I didn't do a good enough job at um, controlling my shots, I think. So at least that's given me a bit of confidence back that I can kill a wolf with a pistol. But that's really, that experience this morning has definitely made me think about um, the positioning of this base and the design. I mean, that's really easy for them to run up. I never had that at my old base because I was elevated on the rocks. It's 
so that was very interesting. Now I don't want to upset that, that hunter again, which I think is over in this sort of direction, but... I think we've got all of those. So I'm going to record another episode after this one, I think, and uh, try and do some more logging. I think what I should have done maybe is maybe put the base here on this outcrop rather than um, flat, and then I could have enclosed this. But there's no reason we can't expand it. <laughs> we can we can go in this way now. <laughs> oh my God! What fun is this? Oh look, right, right, okay, we're, we're alright for um, berries actually. Uh, I'm going to make another berry water. Um, right, let's put chickens away in the box. Um, because we've got a rabbit, we've got a couple of, um, we've got a steak and stuff now. Uh, we'll take that cordage, we'll take those planks. Um, what else? We've got that cordage there as well. So. All right, let's uh, cook some food. So oh, I could probably put these away too. Render fast. I'll try and leave that fuel brick to the very last minute. Let's put this away. What have we got in here then? Another chicken and a couple of rabbits. And in here we'll put these strap, nails, ammo. Uh, oh look we've got quite a bit of um, ore. Right we're going to need definitely a wooden wall. Oh I need the nails back. Only 20. Yeah I'm going to have to repair then. That definitely tells me we're going to have to repair. Pencil. What I might do I might move that wall down. I wonder if by moving the wall it resets the stability. It's a bit of a cheat, cheating thing to do. But I'm wondering if it if it resets the, the stability of the... I wonder if you can move a damaged wall. I better do the food first. Otherwise I'm only going to end up regretting my life choices. Okay, we'll eat the rest of that steak in a minute. Right, let's get up these stairs. Okay. Move. Can we move? It'll be a bit of a cheat if it does. But. Oh my goodness me. Leave me alone. <laughs> uh, right, rotate. Oh no, it remembers! How clever! Oh my god. Go away, bear. Oh my god. What do I need for a hammer? I'm going to need to repair these walls then. Uh, wow. Three cloth for a hammer. No! Three cloth and four scrap. Oh my god. Oh, that's a shame. That's, oh, that was my little pile, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. What did I have that set aside for? I can't remember. Let me put that back. I've got one cloth there. And I've got no cloth in there. But I do have these two rabbits. Oh, damn it. No, I'm going to have to use it. I'm going to have to make a, a hammer. I can't leave it like this. Right, hammer time. Yes, I, I, I went there. <laughs> How many logs have I got? 43. Oh, jeez. Right, let's make the door. And at least now we can put a window up on the landing. 
That's something, I suppose. Okay. So. Um, number... Yep, that one there. Okay. That's nearly gone. Look at this. Down to... Oh my god. It was down to eight. That one nearly went to... This one's this one's okay. This is all right too. Are the stairs okay? Stairs are okay. Ah, oh, right. Um, door. I think we'll put it on as it looks. Good. Okay. And then up here we need to put that wall with the window. And I can't see a thing. That doesn't look right, does it? That really doesn't look right at all. Why is it doing that? Right, rotate round. That's better. Oh, how about that? It's quite surprising how much damage they did, or he did. Uh, we've got 35 logs left, so we can still do a little bit more um, repairs uh, outside. But I'm very impressed that it remembers the uh, state of damage. So you can't sort of tweak the, you can't tweak the system. Uh, I'd better get down and put a fuel brick in. That must almost be out now. <laughs> wow, that was so exciting though. I did enjoy that. So we've got plenty of food. We don't need to do food in the next episode, that's for sure. Um, that is really good. Um, and I don't, I, I've got five arrows. I'm not going to use any more. Uh, nails, um, making arrows, which is great. Now, hammer on this foundation here. Now, I think this is a much better return. Instead of uh, nearly dying trying to fight that hunter and not being ready for it. We've walked away. No damage. And for the sake of a bit of logging, we're in a good spot. Let's put the hammer away in here with all the nails and stuff. Now what was this for? We got six planks and something was for... Oh, I can't remember what it was. I think this is damaged actually. Better have a look. Uh, we wanted the bed, which was uh, six scrap and ten feathers and five cloth. So six scrap, ten feathers and five cloth. So we've got one cloth. And then what was this for down here? This was for the well, I think. Or maybe the mass storage. Let's have a look. Six, six and six. Oh, we could almost do that if we put the um, generator on uh, very soon. We might do that in the morning before we set out. Uh, six, six and six. I think that's what that was. What? Mm, hang on a second. Mass storage. Six scraps, six electrical. Yeah, I moved the, um... Okay, so we can do that in the morning, hopefully. We'll turn the generator on and give us a... Oh, well, why have I only got that much, um, gunpowder? That's odd, isn't it? You normally run out of casings. Need to reload the, um, weapon. 
going to make another fuel brick ready for the next day because I'm out. We've got a steak. We've got nails, plank, planks and um, cordage. Oh, that one is full. We've got this base light we could put up somewhere. That that's fine, we'll just let that stack for now. Actually I'm gonna keep this on me. I think it was six six and six, was it? Mass storage. Yeah, five hundred yeah, okay. Let's get the generator on. We've got the fuel, so let's do that. Um, okay, good. Uh, I need to repair that uh, wall here, I think. Yeah, 404. <laughs> this isn't damaged, is it? I hope not. Copper and iron. We're doing okay for all of this. I'm just going to leave this off for the moment. Let it catch up. Um, I'll put the hammer away. But we should have some logs left. this damaged. No, no, nothing else is, uh, it's been hit. It was just, um, he did a huge job on that area. Such a surprise when that happened though. And I heard him outside. It was so, um, yeah, really surprising. Excellent. Okay. Um, what I was thinking about doing here, um, and I might try that before we uh, end the episode, is putting a foundation in um, some stairs. Oh my word. He damaged the light. Has he damaged that? He hasn't damaged that. <gass> so, oh. Slight bit of damage to my BCU. I bet he was quite pleased with himself. Uh, so, let's take this this and these and make a foundation with some stairs. That's the last of our nails. We can't do any more building after this. And what uh, we were doing mass storage in here I think. Almost ready for that. In fact we can do it now. So I'm going to turn that off, save as much as we can and let's just very quickly, we'll put the hammer away and um, there we go, that's kind of surprised me that happening today, you can probably tell but it was fun, definitely was fun okay so the idea here is then to make an exit on this uh, this level here so we'll spin this round, bring it back. Now, does that reach the floor? It does. How about that? And we'll put a door here. So we'll have another exit. I quite like that. But we've run out of nails now, so we can't do that for now. So I'm going to place the um, mass storage in the back in the back here out the way number six bring it forward a touch lovely okay now we can't get any more mass than we will naturally generate up to 100 because uh, we'll need the mass fabricator but at least it gives us the capacity now and this should at least um, uh, we could top that up to uh, a thousand if we run the generator for a while, so that's good. And we've got our uh, steak to eat, the, eat there. We will eat, that is our last berry and I wi might like to keep that for a, um, a berry water. But we'll reload the pistol. We'll head back up here, have a look. How does this look now? back up into the corner now. Can't believe that guy <laughs> blew up our house. 
But anyway, that's where I'm going to leave the episode. So I hope you enjoyed that one. A bit of a dramatic start. Um, I should have fought back, but I'd only got a limited amount of ammo. No real amount of health kits or bandages. And for the sake of a bit of wood, we got away unscathed. So, you know, that's the decision I made. Whether it was right or not, it was my decision, my game. Probably not what some of you would have done, but um, it worked out for me. So, until next time, take care and I'll see you again soon. Thanks for watching.